It's beer o'clock on Real Old Craft Beer. Today we're going to beer from Tenants Caledonia Brewery and it's a bottle of their Double Hop, a citrus hopped lager coming in at 5% ABV. There's the gold bottle cap. Bit of print on the bottle cap there. I'm going into this beer review with the knowledge that I picked up this beer for about £1.20 uh, in Lidl in the UK. Nice bit of smoke on the bottle opening. So I'm not expecting, even though they put double hop, I'm not really expecting too much of a hop presence in this beer. Am I being negative before the review started? No, not really. I'm just going to be perfectly honest with you guys. At £1.20, you're not going to get an awful lot of ingredients in, in a beer at 5% ABV. Which, which leads you to, should it be called double hop? We'll get round to all of that in a moment. Once I get, there's a bit of beer left in the bottle. Let me show you the, the glass of beer. It's a two to three finger. White head, good levels of carbonation, golden colored lager, cleared as you like. Let's get the aroma. I tell you what, it, the aroma for me is that of a, like a Chang, Chang beer, something like that, or I'm just trying to think of some beers now, some, some like continental lager aromas to the beer, maybe some San Miguel, maybe a Foster's or a Castlemaine 4X. sort of thing. There is a touch of lemon, there is a touch of bite coming from the hop aroma. Let's dive in. Cheers everybody. So bearing in mind it was £1.20, it's not actually that bad. It tastes a lot better than the aroma gives. Well, the aroma was, was not very good, to be honest, but the taste is quite a bit better. Just hold your nose while you're drinking it. Quite acidic, mind. It's, it's carbonated, it's... it's me personally, I won't be able to drink many of these. Um, I've never really been a lager drinker anyway. Um, picked this up in order, in order to review it because they brewed it. Tenants Caledonia. A lot of people will buy it. A lot of people might tune into this beer review for a bit of reference, for a bit of guidance. Um, if you've tuned into this beer review and you really like the beer, and it's your staple beer, and you're, bit, you're a bit disappointed as to why I'm being just a tad negative towards the beer you like. Well, yes, there's a lot better beer out there, but you can pay anywhere from, from three to four to five pounds for that better beer. It is a lot better, mind. I'm going to be perfectly honest with you. Um, there's a little bit of multi. Corn, rice flavours, maybe some maize flavours coming through. Um, it's a very typical, very dry lager. Um, it would probably taste a lot better if I cooled it down. It's been on the shelf. Uh, it's probably about eight, nine degrees. Um, but then again, when you when you cool it down, you're taking all of the tastes away. By drinking a beer at this temperature, you're able to, to really gauge what's in the beer, what what's going on in the beer. So there's a touch of lemon coming through from the from the hop. Um is it is it double hopped? Well it could be. It could be. Let's let's think about this for a second now. If you put a handful of hops into this regular beer. 
Then you've got to, oh, you've only got to put two handfuls of hops in and then you've double hopped it, haven't you? So yes, they can get away with saying that. Um, for the craft beer people who, who, who follow me on a, on a on a maybe monthly, weekly, daily basis, uh, you will understand that it's not really a, 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 um, a hoppy beer as, as we like to call hoppy beer. But I suppose, again, it's okay for £1.20 if you like lager. It's something different. That's, that's the rest of the beer. Um, so it's, it's been descri it's described also as a citrus hopped lager. So again, very vague description uh, of the beer. Double hopped lager with a slight fruity flavour and clear bitterness. So who on earth has wrote this description? This has come, I reckon the cleaner at Caledonia, Tenants Caledonia, they asked the cleaner to, to, to write the description of the beer. I'll read that again to you guys so you can just listen to it one more time. Double hopped lager with a slight fruity flavour and clear bitterness. What on earth is clear bitterness? Well, well done to the cleaner at Tenants for coming up with a description. 5% uh, ABV. I'm going to rate it. Um, it's... It's not my cup of tea. You probably guessed it by now. If I was a lager drinker, if I wanted a 5% lager, if I wanted something slightly hoppy for a lager, and if I wanted to pay £1.20 for a beer, then you're going to be happy. But I, I'm, I'm not really that happy. <laughs> Let's rate it. It's not a beer that I would look to ever put to my lips again. Um, in, in fact, the sun is out. Um, it's Friday afternoon here in the UK. Um, I was going to take a few beers out into the garden after, after this review and, and have a bit of a sit down. But I, I, I might just pour this one away. It's just, just, you can feel it, the acidity and everything, just, just the... That kind of carbonation that's building up in your stomach. It just it just doesn't it just doesn't feel very nice. It, it, you've got a very metallic taste left and Oh well, it was only one pound twenty. Uh, let's rate it. For me this gets a very sorry four out of ten. It's a four out of ten from Reload Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box, subscribe to our daily beer reviews, give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! And cheers.